Hi guys. See drama greets you. Ji Xing was assigned by her supervisor to follow up on the software operation at the hospital. During the process, she saw many patients becoming impatient due to a malfunction in the hospital's smart medical system. Ji Xing took the initiative to check the smart software system and soon resolved the issue allowing the hospital to function normally again. The malfunctioning system was actually managed by Han Ting's company, and he quickly came over. Seeing Ji Xing single-handedly fix the problem, Han Ting was very grateful. Ji Xing smiled and said that they were even now. As they left the hospital together, Han Ting invited Ji Xing to ride with him. Ji Xing, wary of the comments on the internal network, declined, saying she didn't want to be talked about. Han Ting understood Ji Xing's concerns and suggested she shouldn't let rumors hinder her. Someone reported Ji Xing's achievement at the hospital to her supervisor. Originally intending to suppress Ji Xing, the supervisor found himself helping Ji Xing gain more recognition instead. Seng De unceremoniously punished the supervisor. To put pressure on Ji Xing, the supervisor called her to the office and assigned her parts of the work from the R&D marketing and sales departments. Ji Xing was dumbfounded as she was clearly from the marketing department and now had to do basic work as well. When Ji Xing questioned this, the supervisor stammered and couldn't explain, only saying that since she was an elite, she should take on more responsibilities. Ji Xing recalled hearing the supervisor in the restroom discussing how they kept giving her false promises to make her work harder. Seeing the supervisor's worsening behavior, Ji Sheng became even angrier. She had a glimmer of hope when she went to see Seng De, but Seng De had already developed a strong dislike for Ji Sheng due to the rumors about her and Han Ting. Ji Sheng, being young and beautiful, was now more urgently being pushed out of the company. After expressing her grievances to Seng De and seeing her cold reaction, Ji Sheng decisively resigned. The supervisor, seeing Ji Zing's resignation letter, immediately sneered and told her she had a month's notice period during which she must complete all her tasks. Fed up with the supervisor's attitude, Ji Sheng threw away her work ID and walked out. She knew this meant forfeiting her month's salary and bonuses. As she left the company, she crossed paths with Han Ting. Although they didn't speak, Han Ting understood the situation and asked Tang Song to arrange another interview for Ji Sheng. While at home after resigning, Ji Sheng kept busy. A junior, knowing she was temporarily unemployed, invited her to join his 3D printing project. Ji Sheng had previously helped him with a business plan and was familiar with the project, but she was unsure if she could apply her expertise and hesitated. One day, Ji Sheng received an invitation for the new field fishing village investigation project, a grassroots survey. She was dining with a friend at the time and was unsure about going. Her friend, having browsed pictures of the beautiful village scenery, suggested that Ji Sheng take the opportunity to relax. Seeing the company project itinerary, Han Ting deliberately scheduled his trip to the fishing village to spend more time with Ji Sheng. On the first day in the village, Ji Sheng accidentally ran into Han Ting. Han Ting suggested she consider another development company with comparable salary and benefits. The fishing village being quite remote had many villagers who delayed treatment because of the inconvenience of visiting big hospitals. Han Ting investigated the village's situation and placed the company's smart dentist Xiao Bai in the village's health clinic, which received a lot of praise. Ji Sheng, the developer of this smart software, was delighted to see her work making a difference. Among the people Ji Xing treated was an unfortunate patient who had lost a leg in a car accident. Unable to afford a prosthetic limb, the patient found walking very painful. Seeing Ji Xing's expression, Han Ting knew she was thinking of her mother. Learning more about the woman's tragic story the next day, Ji Xing was deeply moved. She recalled her junior's invitation to the 3D printing project and thought about how meaningful it would be to create an affordable prosthetic limb for this unfortunate person. In the evening, unable to sleep, Ji Sheng walked to the seaside alone, thinking about work. At this time, Han Ting also came, and the two met unexpectedly. Mention in the comments if you are waiting for the next episode.